right, we are recording. Welcome to this fast thought. This is coming to you from Phil's living room. Um, we have a guest star on with us today. Her name is Sophie. She's a little upset because um, my wife and my daughter put a tank top on her, which she's not really happy about. So she doesn't look upset. That's why she's moping. Oh, that's moping. That's moping. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, sorry, Soph. <laughs> sorry, I saw you moping. <laughs> See, that's definitely moping. Yeah, that is a little bit yeah, moping. That's pretty mopey. Get over it. Um, actually, I'm doing work. That's why I'm on the phone. So, so Kenny and I, Kenny's in Toronto, um, and then we are heading down to New York. I think we talked about we talked about that somewhere, right? Did we talk about it in the last fast thought? Mm. We can't remember, remember what we said. Maybe we did. Maybe we didn't. But, I, honestly, um, I honestly don't know if we talked. But about um, it or not. we we did anyway. We're going to New York tomorrow. tomorrow. We're driving down bright and early, uh, bright and early, because uh, we're going to the fancy food show, and um, I guess we're we're excited. So I think we're going to try and do some filming from there. So hopefully you get some footage that's interesting, that won't make you throw up. Um, you know, Even if we don't do a film, but we'll definitely record something yeah, because I think it's going to be a pretty cool show. Yeah. This is the. Yeah. First time I've been in probably mm, maybe six, seven years. Yeah. So I think it'll be good. Okay. And I think this is the first. It's the first non, time like no more yeah. COVID. Yeah. Like this will be like, like yeah. sort of CHFA was and probably yeah. Expo West was this year. Yeah. Where it's a little bit more yeah. blown up. So I think it's going to be a good show. Yeah. It's going to be, be a good, good show. show. I'm and excited. We're in New York City. So. And it's New York City. Yeah. So yeah, really, yeah, how yeah. bad can it be? Yeah. Yeah. Um, one thing that we wanted to talk to you about today Um almost like a, a little bit of a public service announcement. Um, and the PSA is really like, there are some pretty cool things that have opened up. Um, you know, I guess the top of mind ones like CHFA and BC Food and Bev. Um, you, you guys know that we do a lot of work with those guys. With We're both huge of fans of, of both um, Aaron and Lindsay at CHFA and, and their whole team, they're fantastic. And then Elisa and, and Jim um, at uh, BC Food. Yeah, and, and James at, at BC Food and Sumner. Can't forget Sumner. No. Um, I know some Sumner, Kenny might want to forget you, but I Sometimes won't. Sometimes I do, you. but that's okay. Still um, like Sumner. But both of both of those organizations have um, this amazing thing they do, right? They they do um, kind of a new product. It's a new product of the year. Yeah. Right. And I think Phil and I were sort of talking today because we actually like it was actually quite nice. We got to see Lindsay today. Yeah. And we were talking about it with, um, yeah, with Lindsay at CHFA. And I just, I sometimes just wonder why more don't take advantage, more advantage yeah. of it. Yeah. And if it's not going to be the brand themselves nominated themselves, yeah. I don't think you can do that. Yeah. Maybe no, you can. No, no. Brands, brands can, oh, you can submit themselves. Yeah. So I think you should submit yeah. yourself or yeah. at least get your friends within, let's say those two organizations, yeah. either of those two organizations, to submit you yeah right because yeah. i think it's you know first off it doesn't cost anything yeah you're already a member yeah i think it's a really good way for you to get some probably free pr a yeah. couple free yeah you know you get some you get some posts some yeah. social media yeah that can't you get hurt. some announcements um, you know you get like people potentially people talking about it you yeah, yeah. if you're yeah. you know because they repost both of them on linkedin etc buyers hang out on yeah. linkedin retailers hang out on linkedin yeah maybe they're thinking oh shit that's pretty cool that's i know product. i really I like know. that never saw I that know. one coming yeah. maybe something yeah. like that and i just think it's it's you know if, if you go down even that path you know maybe the buyer or somebody like that sees you at a show or recognizes yeah. you somewhere yeah i mean you never know what comes out of it right i, I think sometimes i don't i don't know what it is i don't think it's ever been taken this is probably this is just me so it's not this is not fact, but I don't think it's ever taken as seriously as it could be. Right. I think yeah. people look at it as, oh yeah, whatever. And I don't think you should. I think it doesn't cost you anything and why not yeah. put yourself on a pedestal or put your friend on a pedestal, nominate them. Like, yeah. I don't know, just, I think, I think what we're trying to, we're trying to tell you to do something we don't do very well, which is, um, you know, to, to ask, to, to put yourself on the radar so that you can ask for help if you will. Um, because there's just so many of these resources that are so amazing that I think you, you could definitely take advantage of and then 
you know, get yourself some free PR. I think so too. Missed opportunities. Um, this is definitely yeah. a do as we yeah. say, not as we generally do. <laughs> yeah. Right. So yeah. go, it's not complicated. It's not hard. Yeah. It's why you're doing this. Yeah. Go for it. Yeah. So definitely I would pay attention to those. And then, and then the truth is any show that you want to go to, there are lots of magazines too. Um, our friend, uh, Ryan Ben. Yeah. And um, live at publishing. And, and, and live publishing and all those guys will have stuff as well. And so I think you're kind of always looking for a moment where you can apply for things and, and, um, you know, kind of Ooh. can do that work. So I think, um, when you, you know, so as you look for next year, like, so you think of, cause I, I think the other reason for the PSA is because we are where we are, we're kind of like, middle of the year, about to make the turn to the back half. Yep. Trade show season, for the most part, is more or less over before it's September It's going to start winding starts. down after, after yeah. the, that. Yeah, right? That's like what CHFA, it kind of starts to slow yeah. down because you get into Christmas, yeah. busiest time of the year for retail. So Yeah, and and like you, you will get some shows in the fall and stuff like that. Yep. But um, I, think, I think it's important, like, so you start looking now, right? Agreed. Figure out where you are. If you build one submission, you've built, a couple of submissions yep, agreed. and then you circulate and you try and put yourself as many places as you can possibly be. Right. So, agreed. Um, and then that way you get lots of press, you get, uh, you get picked up by people, people who want to know what your story is and all those sorts of things. Right. So that, you know, you can kind of get into, um, you can get a little bit more news around you, a little more hype. Right. And I think at this time yeah. when we're all, you know, a little more yeah. conscious of money, yeah. free is a nice one. Free is really nice. Is good. Free publicity is good. Free is free. good. You know, and then um, I think the other one that's really cool that we were talking to Lindsay about is being able to get, um, you know, really good feedback, right? Like um, you think of the people who sit on these panels who judge awards and things like that. <laughs> Typically, you get people who are in retail spots or who have been buyers. Or from the um, industry, been in the industry know, for 30 yeah. years or something, right? Yeah. So it's a chance to practice your pitch. Totally. It's a chance to maybe get feedback that, um, you know, cause sometimes when you're a brand, you get a lot of like fan feedback. That's like, Oh, this is awesome. You should totally sell this. But like buyers have different views on things, right? Like they think about things that nobody else does. Um, profits turns, you know, what's um, it going to retail at? Yeah. Where's it going to go in yeah. the store? Why did yeah. you do this? Why did you do that with, right? right? Like all of these sort of things. So I think you have to think about all of those things and then having the ability to, like hear about some of that from judges helps you with your pitch as well. Right. And it ultimately prepares you for going um, in to see a buyer. So I agree. Yeah. It makes it just a lot easier to do yeah. an actual yeah. pitch when you need to. Plus you've also get to know five or six people because you've presented on stage that yeah. you can track down at the show for yeah. more information. Yeah. Right. Even if you get yeah. 10 minutes with each, that's like an hour out of six yep. people, you know, in, in total yep. six people. It's not bad. Yeah, it's pretty good you feedback, know, take too. take it. It's, uh, it's really good stuff. I think it's a good idea. I anyway, mean, I just wish more yeah. people would sign up. I, and I don't, it, I mean, I think CHFA opened now, like not today. I don't know. Like now don't know when it opened, but it's open. Now. I know BC Food and Beverage <laughs> opened up, I think, yeah. last week. Yeah. So, like, you know, take the, take the couple minutes, nominate yourself, nominate yeah. your friend. Yeah. And then we'll, we'll have a look if, if there are other ones, we'll throw them in links below. Yeah. But definitely we know CHFA and um, BC, BC food and Bev, uh, food and Bev are yeah. open. You should definitely take advantage. If you think for a second, you couldn't win. It doesn't really matter. Um, one is you could win, right? Well, you could. And, and then two is it doesn't really matter. It's not about the winning. It's uh, the winning has benefits to it, but, um, but, Submitting has I think some submitting major is, benefits. Absolutely. To it and I think that's yeah. the easiest part. You don't have to do yeah. much. Plus, with each of those two groups, I think all the nominees get stuck with us for 10 or 15 minutes of a yeah, fast Yeah, thought. I think so. So, if that's a prize to so. you, I would sign up right now. Okay. Anyway, that's our PSA slash fast thought um, for the Friday. And then from um, the Chang House in yeah, Mississauga. From the Chang House um, guest star, Sophie. Um, she doesn't. Who's still yeah, not very happy, but that's she's okay. She's not happy. Um, oh, that was a poke. Yeah. <laughs> thanks, guys. Um, thanks. We'll see you later.